These days, full-size luxury cars are as much about on-road comfort as they are about showcasing an automaker's latest and greatest technology. Features like scent diffusers, trillion-color ambient lighting, and ceiling-mounted theater screens often take center stage, overshadowing the essence of simple, straightforward luxury. However, the Lexus LS bucks this trend. If you seek a full-size luxury sedan that prioritizes a smooth, coddling ride, the LS is your ideal choice. Specifically, the LS 500H model ditches the base twin-turbo 3.4-liter V6 in favor of a hybrid powertrain. This setup combines a naturally aspirated 3.5-liter V6 with two electric motors. The motors work with the engine through a planetary gear set. One motor acts mainly as a generator, while the other can drive the rear wheels using electric power alone, yielding a total of 354 horsepower. While this is less than the 416 horsepower from the base 3.4-liter engine, it promises greater efficiency in exchange for slightly reduced performance. On paper, the Lexus LS 500H lags behind its primary competitors. In our tests, it reached 60 miles per hour in 5.6 seconds, trailing the 536 horsepower BMW 760i xDrive, 3.5 seconds, and the 429 horsepower Mercedes S500, 4.6 seconds. The BMW 740i, with its 375 horsepower, also offers more power. Although we haven't tested it yet, the factory claims it can hit 60 miles per hour in 5.2 seconds. The LS 500H's quarter mile performance is similarly underwhelming, taking 14.3 seconds at 99 miles per hour, which is more than a second slower than the Mercedes and over two seconds behind the BMW. Further testing only highlights the width of the LS 500H's performance chasm. Wearing a set of Bridgestone Terranza EL450 all-season tires, the LS made its way around the skid pad with a paltry 0.81G of grip. The Germans we tested both arrived on Pirelli P0PZ4 summer rubber, dramatically improving their skid pad ratings. The 7 Series achieved 0.89G, while the S-Class stands atop the podium at 91 centimos. The Lexus's mediocre grip also led to a 177-foot stop from 70 miles per hour, needing 17 feet more than the BMW and 19 feet more than the Mercedes. But the LS 500H is a hybrid, so it must be more efficient, right? Well, hybrids get the most benefit from their electron motivation at lower speeds. So a 31 miles per gallon result from our 75 miles per hour real-world highway fuel economy test proves no more efficient than the S500, and the 7 Series was just one mile per gallon behind. The data may not paint the greatest picture of the Lexus LS, but there are a couple of reasons for this. First, the current generation of LS debuted for the 2018 model year, which means this car is a little long in the tooth, while the BMW and Mercedes have received major overhauls in that span of time. Second, what we appreciate about the LS isn't quantifiable. Instead, it's about the experience. The LS feels decidedly old school in execution. Every input is muted and dead simple to modulate without a hint of passenger head bobs. Even the threshold between friction and regenerative braking is super smooth. The steering is over-boosted to hell and back, and we're pretty sure we could crisscross the country with little beyond a pinky finger's worth of effort. A standard air suspension makes no sacrifices for handling. Yes, there's a stiffer sport mode, but the LS doesn't feel as planted as the Germans, and it's immensely comfortable in daily operation, soaking up just about every imperfection the road has to offer. Sure, there's a small hiccup as the electric motors make way for the internal combustion engine to kick in, but that's the most jarring part of the entire LS experience. The transmission, a mishmash of a continuously variable unit created by the planetary gear set with four fixed ratios thrown into the mix, isn't our favorite, especially in this upper echelon of luxury where traditional automatics reign supreme. But we experienced very few situations where the CVT held the V6 at a noisy part of the rev range. In fact, at wide open throttle, we recorded 70 decibels in the Lexus, the quietest of the three cars we've discussed. Keep your throttle work light, and you'll jet off to rides like A, Cloud City. Hop into either the S-Class or 7 Series cabin, and you might wonder if you landed in a casino in Macau. Screens, lights, and other check out my Instagram details cover nearly every corner of their cabins. The LS, on the other hand, 
offers a straightforward combination of much welcome, physical switchgear, and buttery soft leather. A 12.3-inch touchscreen runs the latest infotainment software found on other new Lexus and Toyota vehicles, and it's a welcome replacement for the mousepad-based user interface we grew to revile. Our test car lacks the ultra-fancy cut glass trim, but there isn't a single corner of this cabin that feels lacking. The only true annoyance is that the seat massage controls are hidden behind at least two button presses. The horror. In addition to offering a simpler luxury car than its German counterparts, Lexus also makes a value play at the base end. The LS starts at $80,685 for its gas-fed LS500, which is about $15,000 below the cheapest BMW 7 Series and almost $40,000 less than a bare-bones Mercedes S-Class. The LS Hybrid's $115,560 base price eliminates most of that gulf, but it still rings in under anything from the S-Class lineup. If driving verve and on-paper points of comparison matter most to you, the Lexus LS would likely float right past your eyes unnoticed. But if you want a paragon of comfortable handling without a bunch of frippery that seems best suited for putting your service advisor's kids through college, the LS 500H keeps things laser-focused on comfort. 2024 Lexus LS 500H. Refining luxury, one smooth ride at a time. The 2024 Lexus LS 500H remains a refined titan in the world of full-size luxury sedans. While it may not be the flashiest contender, it prioritizes what Lexus does best. Unparalleled comfort and a focus on a serene driving experience. Effortless power and tranquility. The LS 500H boasts a powerful and efficient hybrid powertrain. The twin-turbo V6 engine delivers ample acceleration while the electric motor ensures smooth, near-silent operation at low speeds. However, some reviewers mention that this smoothness can come at the expense of a truly thrilling driving experience, car and driver. A sanctuary for the senses. Step inside the LS 500H and you're enveloped in a luxurious cabin crafted with high-quality materials. Supportive seats and an abundance of legroom ensure utmost comfort for both driver and passengers. The focus here is on quiet, with the car excelling at isolating you from road noise. Technology with a human touch. Lexus equips the LS 500H with all the expected safety and driver assistance features. The infotainment system leans towards user-friendliness over excessive bells and whistles, a welcome change for those seeking a less distracting driving experience, car and driver. However, some reviewers mentioned that the optional teammate semi-autonomous driving system lags behind competitors' offerings, CarWow. The verdict, a luxurious oasis, but not without rivals. The 2024 Lexus LS 500H is a compelling choice for those seeking a luxurious, comfortable, and refined driving experience. Its serene cabin and silky smooth ride are unmatched. However, if you crave a more dynamic driving experience or the latest in tech features, German rivals like the Mercedes S-Class and BMW 7 Series might be more enticing options. Ultimately, the choice comes down to your priorities. If unparalleled comfort and a tranquil driving experience are paramount, the LS 500H remains a top contender.